Hi guys, welcome back to Honest Straightforward Reviews. Today I've got a quick short video for you guys just comparing undervolting the CPU. Now my GPU is not undervolted, it's not overclocked, nothing, it's just stock with high fans. Hence why it's running so cool. Also, it's got a really beefy cooler. I'll get into that later. I'll be doing the review of the, which what I'm running is the RTX 4080 Aorus Master, and I will be doing a review of that. So please do watch my videos and subscribe to support my work and ensure that I keep doing what I'm doing here. So first of all, what I, what I would like to show you guys is my, so this is the last of us game and it's building shaders right now and it's really cpu intensive okay and gpu intensive but mainly cpu intensive now what i want you guys to look at is what my uh, cpu is running at so it's running at about 4300 okay and the voltage goes around 120 ish so 100 to 120 ish the usage goes up to 100 but keeps dropping down and it's really struggling with temperature. So what I want, don't want it to do is hit 80. So as soon as the fans hit about 70, it ramps up to 100%. So that's why it's uh, going around at 73. Now, I don't know how, how well the sound noise suppression goes, but I will take it next to the fans and so you guys can hear what I am hearing. So those are the fans for stock everything. So I haven't undervolted the CPU. Everything is stock. Uh, just the fans are ramped up. Okay. So let's look at five. Okay. Let's bring it down by five. So this is PBO tuner, PBO2 tuner. As you guys might be aware, the 70, the 5800X 3D isn't able to be tuned it's not allowed uh, through uh, ryzen master or through the uh, motherboard uh, uh, traditionally so in the traditional way but you can do it here so let's do that by five So now I've got a little shortcut, a nifty way of just going by five and this is by 30. So I've reduced it by five and let's see what happens here. Let's watch it. So as you guys can see, it's starting to fluctuate a bit higher. So it's going all the way to 4450 and hovering around 4400 goes down to 4370, 4350, but no longer going to 4300. Okay, so that was the low, the usage is about the same but it's capping around at 116 117 it's not a massive undervolt it's a tiny undervolt the temperature and usage is stabilizing as well so the temperature is sticking around 74 and the usage is around 9900 but goes down a tiny bit now let's let's bump that really high to the highest which is 30 okay so 30 is the highest and let's see what happens so I've got it at, okay, I'll just close this off, open PBO tuner again. So as you guys can see, now it's at 30. So let's close this off and let's see what happens. So f immediately what you guys will see is the droppage of usage isn't as much. Okay, it's, well, there it was, but you can start seeing the voltage really start to come down. Look at that temperature. It's really coming nicely below the 70 degree mark, which is where the fans are set to just go all the way to 100. Look at that, guys. Look at the megahertz. It's a stable 4450, okay? So 4450. And I'll give you guys a hair of the fans as well. They've turned down a tiny bit. So the CPU usage, everything else is the same. So that's basically it, guys. So what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments from my finding. I'm a, I am never used to undervolt, but I, I, first time I saw the real benefit of undervolting with an overclock. This is not with an overclock. There's no overclock. There's just a hard underclock, undervolt. And the first time I ever saw it was when I was playing around with an overclocked 
SFX, Speedsith, Merc 319, RX 6900 XT Black Edition. And I saw massive improvements when I did that with that. So anyways, the shader is done. If you guys are wondering why it's going going so low, the reason is because the uh, building the shaders been finished but anyways guys that's basically it i hope you guys enjoyed it please do donate it helps me survive this is a tiny channel let me know what I, how i'm doing and yeah thanks for watching it today and take good care bye bye